In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to normalize, compress, and equalize in Audacity. And I'm going to do even better. I'm going to tell you what each of these effects actually do to your audio. So you know exactly what you are doing. Deal? Let's dive right in. Okay. So in this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to normalize, compress, and equalize right here in Audacity. And I'm going to go ahead to tell you what each of these effects do so that you understand exactly what you are doing. Um, but before then, I'm going to go ahead right now to record the audio that we are going to use for this tutorial, okay? Okay, so here is a quick rundown of the different personality types, the popular sanguine, the powerful choleric, the perfectionist melancholic, and the peaceful phlegmatic. Alright, okay, so here is our audio track. Just looking at the track, you can see the waveform is a little bit even at the beginning and then it begins to get some sharp peaks. Okay, so what I'm going to do, uh, first of all, the first effect I usually apply in my recordings or to my vocals is noise reduction. But I'm not going to do it here because I've already done a separate tutorial on how to do noise reduction but before i go ahead to apply this effect you see this part of the waveform that is speaking um okay i think what we should do is i'm going to duplicate this track this recording so that um, i'm going to work with a duplicate so that we can keep this one and do a comparison of the the audio how the how it sounds before and after applying this effect Okay, so I'm going to, going to mute out this first track. We'll compare with it when we are done. We're going to work with this. Uh, okay, so just looking at this um, waveform, you see this part that is speaking too loud. When you have something like this in your recording, I suggest, I recommend that you deal with it. Otherwise, it's going to affect the quality of the result that you get in your recording. All right, so first of all, I'm going to go ahead now to reduce amplify negative say minus 4 db bring the sound down awesome so the first thing we are going to do is to normalize now this is what normalize does normalize tells audacity that you do not want your audio you don't want your sound to go higher than a particular level okay you don't want it to go higher than a particular level so if it goes higher than that level or there's a sound picking above that level it brings it down so you're applying some sort of a ceiling to the loudness of your sound in audacity so we're going to go ahead now to normalize uh, normalize okay so we're going to normalize i typically normalize to zero db you go ahead and you click ok now you see what happened it has boosted the sound a little again you see this part that is speaking too loud is still going to affect us so um, I'm going to reduce it a little. I'm going to reduce it a little. Amplify minus uh, 3dB. Awesome. Okay, so that's how we do a normalization in Audacity. You can normalize only to parts of the clip or you can normalize to the entire clip. All you do is just select the clip, you go to normalize, and then you click on normalize, then you set the value. Sometimes you may want to normalize to minus 3 dB, minus 2 dB, or even 0 dB, depending on what you want to achieve. So that's it. Okay, so here is a quick rundown of the different personality types. All right. Okay, um, we still have the audio picking at some point. And okay, so let's go ahead now to do the compressor and hope that the compressor is going to fix this part that is trying to pick. All right, so what the compressor does basically is it tells Audacity to, to amplify those parts that are too low and then reduce those parts that are too high. Some parts are too high or too loud, it reduces the loudness. And those parts that are too low, it increases it so that it becomes more audible. And then this is my compressor settings. Different settings will produce different results. Um, okay, so I'm going to write out my settings in the description. Threshold is 10 dB, noise floor minus 45 dB, the ratio 3 to 1, attack time 0 0.1 seconds, release time 2.0 seconds you can apply these settings or you can apply a different setting you can play around these levels to see the result and see which of them works best for you 
So I'm going to go ahead and click OK. Now I've clicked OK. You notice that those parts that we're picking, especially this part, has now that part was too loud. It has now shrink it down a bit. Now this is exactly what we want to achieve with our compressor. Um, but usually, sometimes at the beginning of the clip, it reduces the the loudness at the beginning of the clip where it starts the compression from. So what I usually do, I on my own, I go there and then boost out the loudness at that point to get this even sound. So I'm going to amplify, so say 3 dB. Okay, I think I'm okay with this. Now, but we still have this part that is peaking too loud. And again, you can apply this effect multiple times until you are satisfied. The last of them is the equalization. Equalization is you are trying to play around with the frequency levels. You want to throw away bad frequencies and amplify the good frequencies. In your audio, you notice at some point, maybe your voice is too light, then you want to make it deeper, or your voice is too deep and you want to make it lighter, or you want to get this AM radio effect, or you want to get the telephone effect. You can do all of that with the equalization. So we go ahead, I've highlighted the clip already, and then you come to equalization, and then you see there are some presets already, default um, presets already here. So um, we see, um, let me try the treble boost. Now, if you look at treble boost, you see that the, the, it, the graph here is going as high as up to 9 dB. I don't want that. So if you apply it with this, it's going to make those, those S and T sounds to peak too loud. In fact, let's try it and see. Okay. Now you see this part that are peaking. See this part peaking. This is probably an S sound. Let's listen to it. Peaceful flex peaceful that's peaceful that's, see it? so that's why i do not take my i've on i've undone it control z to undo so we go back again to equalization so that's why i like to bring down come down to treble boosts somewhere below six decibels somewhere below six db here is just fine also okay um so that part is still picking but we're going to apply the compressor to it to fix that and then um, let's try another preset for equalization let's see the the bars the bars boost now again the bars bo is boosting to 9 db we don't want that because it's going to bring in some noise in our recording so i'm going to bring that down to somewhere below 6 db Somewhere below 6 dB is just fine. Okay. Now this is much better. Um, okay, so that's how you, you do equalization in Audacity. So you go ahead, you play around this. You can try other presets. There are other presets there. Um, equalization. There are other presets here. The AM radio, the bass cut. You feel like the bass is too much in a particular part you just select only that part of the clip you apply bass cut or you feel that you want to boost the treble in just on just one particular part of the clip you can do that and then ria -A, you can check it out telephone treble cut the walkie talkie and all of that so that's how you do your equalization in audacity so um let me go ahead now and throw in one more compressor let me compress one more time okay this is good and um, i'll just on my own manually increase the audio level for this beginning part to produce a more even sound amplified to 3 db and this is good so let's have a listen now okay so here is a quick rundown of the different personality types the popular sanguine the powerful choleric the perfectionist melancholic and the peaceful phlegmatic Awesome. Now let's go ahead now to listen to what it was before we apply this effect. In fact, just looking at this two waveform, let's do a, a visual comparison. You see that for the second one, the one we edited, the waveform is wider, you know, it's thicker compared to the other one where it's looking very quiet and, you know. So let's listen to 
let's listen to the first one and see okay so here is a quick rundown of the different personality types the popular sanguine the powerful choleric the perfectionist melancholic and the peaceful phlegmatic okay now let's listen okay so here is a quick rundown of the different personality types the popular sanguine the powerful choleric the perfectionist melancholic and the peaceful phlegmatic awesome awesome okay so this is it this is how we apply this effect in audacity to get the results that we desire all right so that's it guys i hope you enjoyed this tutorial i hope you found it valuable please if you did um hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe so that you get notified whenever i upload a new video tutorial please feel free to check out other tutorials in the channel and i'll see you in the next one